All right, so let's take a look at everything we got first. Let me, I gotta stand back because this is panned out all the way. Uh, first, let me go into here. We have some pure lime juice. Then we've got some tart and sour flavor enhancer for like candies and stuff. Um, right in here we have some, it's bourbon extract. I swear it, sm it smells just like paint thinner. Uh, then we got some little sprinkles and stuff right here. Uh, right here we got some stir fry and uh, there's actually in there there is a red curry, yellow curry and green curry uh, you know little packets right there and then we've got some different kinds of hot chocolate there's a, a rum there's a truffle and some other crap in there um, of course then we've got what's his name um, Wicked Mojo's seasonings that they put in there I still haven't had any room for them so they're going to get thrown in there then we've got some actual uh, lemon stalks or whatever the hell you want to call them. Almond paste, green pesto. Then right in there, that's actually a wasabi powder. And we got some wasabi paste. And some different spices. And then we got like some pumpkin stuff. We got some garlic and blah, blah, blah. And yep, that's hot pepper paste right there. It smells like cayenne pepper, really. Um, over in here, we got a bunch of different. Uh, I don't really remember what everything they are. We've got some hot chow chow. We've got, I don't, I've never seen this, but preserved lemons is what that is right there. I don't, I don't know. And we got a green chili salsa and um, a couple different sweet things in there. And we got some um, diastatic malt powder. Half the stuff I don't even know what you use it for. Then we've got some uh, virgin olive oil. Then the two little gold or copper looking things. That's actually orange olive oil. Then we have some little dipping sauce right there in the middle, right in there. Then uh, some balsamic vinegar back there in the unlabeled little black looking things. Then a bunch of different, you know, seasoning packs. We've got basil, spearmint, bay leaves, uh, whole and chopped bay leaves in there. we got some stuff right here to make your own Italian sausage. There's a, a Polish one back in there. There's uh, some more uh, diastatic malt powder. Um... Organic flax flour. I'm not going to even guess how to spell that or pronounce that. We got some caraway seeds. Um, there's actually right back in there, there's actually it's piri piri uh, seasoning. I smelled it. I haven't tasted it. Smelled it. It smells awesome. Um, and then I don't know what it's for. I'm sure somebody will comment on it. But two little things of whole wheat couscous. I have no idea what it is. Um, then we have some. Uh, cornbread mix, Santa Fe cornbread mix. It's actually I've had it before. It is awesome. Then some uh, some yeast, some instant yeast. Then we got some different. Oops, gotta zoom out here. We got some dough mix, and there's like a sugar-free dough mix in there. There's one thing in here that looks tapioca flour. Then um, let's see. We've got a cheesecake thing right here. Sorry, I got a glare coming in right now. Um, cranberry orange scone mix. Then we've got raspberry white chocolate. They're like little cookie type, like a crispy cookie kind of thing. Um, raspberry white chocolate, stolen mix. I don't, I'm sure somebody will probably let me know, but I don't know what stolen is, but I'm sure somebody will tell me. And then we've got some almond filled sweet bread mix. And then there's some sort of raspberry something or other in there somewhere. But, um, uh, all of that for free. I don't know what I'm going to do with half of this stuff, but I'm going to do my damnedest to find out.